Understanding the phrase, raise the red flag. Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into a fascinating English expression, raise the red flag. This phrase is packed with meaning and history, and it's a great example of how colorful and dynamic the English language can be. So, let's explore what it means, where it comes from, and how you can use it in your everyday English. Raise the red flag is an idiom in English that means to warn of or signal a problem. It's often used when someone notices something suspicious or concerning, suggesting that caution should be taken. The red flag in this phrase symbolizes a warning or danger. For example, if someone says, the company's financial report raised a red flag for the auditors, it means the report indicated potential problems that caught the auditor's attention. The phrase has a rich historical background. The use of red flags as warning signs dates back to various historical contexts, including maritime communication and railway systems. In both cases, a red flag indicated danger or the need for caution. Over time, the concept of using a red flag as a warning sign spilled over into everyday language. In modern English, raise the red flag is used metaphorically. It's common in both professional and personal contexts. Here are a few examples. In the workplace, the manager's disregard for safety procedures raised a red flag among the employees. In personal relationships, his inconsistent stories raised a red flag for her. In general observations, the unusually quiet street at midday raised a red flag. There are variations of this phrase that you might encounter. Phrases like, a red flag, or, red flag something, are used similarly. For instance, someone might say, that's a red flag, to indicate a problem or concern in a situation. We hope this video has shed light on the meaning and usage of, raise the red flag. This phrase is a great example of how idioms enrich the English language, adding color and depth to our expressions. Remember, understanding and using idioms like this can really enhance your English communication skills. Thanks for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in our next video.